Salve ragazzi, io sono Fablinker e oggi siamo qua su The Council per andare avanti Allora, eravamo alla villa praticamente Sempre alla ricerca di, di mamma in poche parole E... Niente Esploriamo un attimo l'ambiente circostante Che dite? Potrebbe essere un'idea entusiasmante I've just arrived. Allora It might be bad manners to go upstairs without being invited non posso andare su Perché sarebbe da maleducati In effetti Non sarebbe il massimo uno che Lord has a taste for Si fa i cavoli suoi a casa degli altri Allora Anche se poi in realtà è gente molto sospetta questa A mio parere Tribulus Terrestris Ah Rivela le... Le immunità e le vulnerabilità È buona sta cosa Molto molto buona Può esserci d'aiuto in caso che non riusciamo a A trovare un modo per andare avanti Con un eventuale personaggio In un dialogo A questo punto andiamo qua Anzi prima Lives of the noble Greeks and Romans By Plutarch A biography of the great men Ah, non posso sfogliarlo, però posso prenderlo Vabbè Cioè, parliamoci chiaro Non è educato ehm, Andare sopra le scale Prima di parlare con i proprietari di casa Però si può, si può rubare dei libri Ottimo, mi sembra Un'ottima cosa E soprattutto molto sensata Mi pensavo che il mio era grande Ma questo è più di credo È il più che può dire Ho avuto un bisogno per un warm fire per anni Since I set foot on the island, I haven't ventured more than two yards away from it. Have you also just arrived? Oh, late morning, I'd say. Louis, come join us. Monsieur, may I introduce you to Monsignor, His Eminence, Cardinal Piaggi? He joins us straight from Rome. Oh, just call me Your Eminence. It's simpler. George Washington, President of the United States of America. Delighted at last to make your acquaintance, Mr. President. Pleased to meet you, Mr. President. Louis Moras de Richet. It is an honor to meet you. Young man, let's keep it simple, please. Let us forget our fancy titles. Nice to meet you, Louis. I should imagine you never thought you'd be in such company. I must admit that I didn't. It's the first time that I've ever met so Ma many questa illustrious musichetta. personalities. And you haven't seen anything Così. yet. Generally, when Lord Mortimer organizes one of his receptions, there are over a dozen people here. They can't all be here yet, and you'll see, most of the time there's only the upper crust. And I noticed you were already getting to know his eminence at the entrance. It's the perfect place to build up a network. What were you talking about, if you forgive my indiscretion? Ha fatto gli affari tuoi, cioè nel senso. Dia madre. At the Così. risk of disappointing you, we weren't conspiring in our corner, sir. His eminence was simply telling me that he knew my mother and how much he held her in high esteem. It so happens that Monsieur de Riche's mother is to join us. Oh, pity. No scrumptious gossip or juicy tidbits, unmentionable secrets or even money matters. But you'll see, it will come. Despite all the goodwill in the world, you can't stop people scheming left and right around oh, here. Speak for yourself, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Well, my friends, do any of you know the reason why we're here this time? Not in the slightest. As for me, I've been invited by Sir Horn, a close friend of Lord Mortimer, but uh, I do not know the reason why. You see, Louis, every time Lord Mortimer organizes a reception, he always finds a moment to set up a chat with all the guests. During which time we remake the world. Accompanied by gallons of absinthe and cussing, I'll leave you to imagine the result. So, if I understand rightly, Monsieur de Richet, you've come out here to join your mother. For what reason, exactly? Ma questo, cosa vuole? Cioè, per, per dire, eh... È scomparsa. Lord Mortimer asked me to drop everything and come find my mother, who seems to have disappeared during her stay here. Ah. Oh. I took the first boat and here I am. I'm so sorry. Don't be, sir. It's not your fault. Forse. 
Seriously, though, I know your mother well. Stay behind with me afterwards, and we'll take a moment to speak about her. You want to do this, sinceramente? Cos'è? Good Lord, Washington is wearing the emblem of the Grand Master of the Golden Order. It's the highest distinction of the order in the United States. It puts him on par with my mother. He must really know his stuff when it comes to the occult. Good evening, my friend. Holy shit. That's the man for my vision. An urgent case has delayed our host, Lord Mortimer. He can't be present this evening, and he sends his deepest apology. Ecco, te pareva. He's asked me here and he hasn't even turned up? Great start. Informati, informati. You know Sir Gregory Holm, an English aristocrat, very influential. He's also close to Lord Mortimer. So don't be surprised if he acts like a man. A me sembrava più una donna che un uomo. And now, my dear guests, a light meal is served in the small salon. For those who would like to, you're invited to follow me into the next room. My dear fellow, you must have read my thoughts. I shall follow. We'll have to be careful not to make too much noise. One of Lord Mortimer's guests is relaxing. Oh, we shall be quiet. Don't take it the wrong way, Sir Holm, but I have already eaten. Thus, I shall be happy to remain by the fireside. If you don't mind, Gregory, I should like to keep Mr. Washington company. Please feel at home. And you, sir? If I stay with Washington, we'll be able to speak about my mother. But on the other hand, I'd like to learn more about this home. I saw him in my vision. Mm. Cosa faccio? Io sinceramente andrei da Holm quasi quasi. Why Ma sì, dai. Let's follow home. Seguiamo Holm. Mr. Washington, I hope to speak with you at greater length on another occasion. Emily, please excuse me, but I would like to speak to Sir Holm. I shall see you later. Ma my friend, I hope our dear Giovanni is well. Ah, the troubles in France have fatigued him, but he will recover slowly. Do not fear. He apologizes for remaining in Rome. The voyage was too much for him. And right he was too. The mildness of the Mediterranean, eh? Come, sit down and have something to eat, my friend. You look rather pale. Excuse me, sir. I have been neglecting my duty. I haven't introduced myself. Sir Gregory Holm, an old friend of Lord Mortimer's. A real pleasure, sir. You who must be well used to the court of France. How do you find this peaceful little haven? Charming, if I hadn't come here for disturbing reasons. Yes, I heard the news. What a story. Indeed. I wanted to ask you. La conosce? You seem to know my mother well, is that true? <laughs> Who does not know of her, sir? She has such a wide circle that everyone knows your mother from a distance or closer. Everyone knows Sarah, my son. But you only know her by her reputation. I remember she once worked for the Crown of England and that she always honors her engagements. However, we have never been personally introduced, Sarah. Well, if I'm to believe my vision, you're not going to get along with her. Thank you for your answers, Sir Holm. But I beg your pardon. I get the impression I know you. Have we met? Except in my dreams, of course. Not that I remember, young man. She must take on. Perhaps you are mistaking me for another member of the Chamber of Lords. And what with the wig and the powder, it wouldn't be the first time. Infatti, no, come si è combinato? You definitely the one I saw threatening my mother. I thought. Never mind. It'll come back to me. Would you allow me one last question, sir? I don't want to take up all your time. Uh, please, go ahead. Um, what do you want to know? Um, chi potrebbe serbar rancore? Could my mother have had a problem with someone during her stay here? No, not at all. Your mother has always been charming company, and everyone got on very well with her. Not even a servant? <laughs> Certainly not. Everyone gets on well with famous Sara de Vice. No! Elizabeth! And what succede? 
I should have insisted that you rest in your room. Do you want me to call someone? Aspettate qui, ci penserò io. Let me handle this. I'm used to this kind of thing. Miss, can can you hear me? Leave me. Osserva la ragazza. Her breathing is becoming stable and her heart rate too. Pale complexion, thin, broken nails, an enormous scar on her temple, tattoos on her hands. I don't know what happened to you, Missy, but it looks like you've been through hell. Can you tell me something about her? Kia. Who is this young lady? Elizabeth Adams. She's come to the island for a course of treatment, to rest. For a course of treatment? That's right. Sia can do wonders. Are you all right, Elizabeth? Do you feel any better? When did she arrive? Four days ago. Okay. My mother had already gone missing. <laughs> Cosa? She's just regained consciousness and she immediately reaches for her brooch. I don't know exactly what it means to her, but obviously it's got to be something important. Are you all right, Elizabeth? You gave us quite a fright. Take it easy, miss. Let me... I just need to get back to my room. Of course, my dear. Go ahead. You saw it, didn't you? Pardon me? Is Senor della Bestia. Sorry, Your Eminence. I don't speak Italian. Ah, forget it. It doesn't matter. Gentlemen, it's getting late. It is time for everyone to go to bed. It has been a long day. C'è qualcosa di sospetto comunque in quella ragazza. E comunque anche se era latino si era capito i segni della bestia, cioè il diavolo. I'll see what I can do, but the case I'm on at the moment might well leave me with very few opportunities. Well, I am impressed with all this splendor. But don't spend too much time with Mr. Washington, my dear, or you'll lose your pretty accent. Ma che ridere, ragazzi, ma che ridere. Absolutely. It is remarkable. Lord Mortimer is fond of atypical works of art. I won't disguise the fact that I find it all a little megalomaniacal. But I must say, he does have some outstanding pieces. Sir Hall, who was that young lady with you? Elizabeth Adams, Mr. President. She would have liked to have stayed with us, but the poor thing is exhausted. Elizabeth Adams? No, I've sbagliato. Just mentioning Elizabeth totally changed Washington's attitude. Looks like he just saw a ghost. Miss Adams is here to rest. You have perhaps already come across her in the corridors. She arrived a few days ago. I perceived her, but we weren't introduced. Rest assured, she is not here for the same reasons as yourselves. Consequently, I'm counting on your indulgence. Washington looks surprised, but Holmes doesn't seem to see it. No, I'm far finta. Being polite, or if he really doesn't see his discomfort. On that note, it's very late. He must be exhausted. The servant will accompany you to your room. Ancora quello, no, basta. Cioè, veramente, oh, è sempre lì a in mezzo quel tizio, sempre in mezzo. Ladies, gentlemen, I bid you all good night. Mr. President, Your Eminence, Duchess, you have the same rooms as usual. You, Monsieur de Richet, will find your room at the end of the corridor. Well, my friends, I am bone tired. I am off to my bed. 
See you in the morning. Good night, sir. I shall do likewise. Louis, I shall see you in the morning. Sleep well. Good night. See you tomorrow. Oh, man. It's been quite a day. Right. Where is my room? Ah, se non lo sei tu. <ride> se non ti hanno detto loro, dov'è la tua stanza? Io non te lo so di. Poco ma sicuro. Dite che posso esplorare o mi tipo mi cacciano da qualche parte. Cosa ho trovato? Monete da collezione. Dove sta le monete? Dove sta le monete? Mm, non lo so Non me le fanno vedere Di qua c'è qualcosa? Addirittura Non si può entrare Magari Sur Jacques Perru A few leaves out of an old encyclopedia Desiderato. Ah. Golden elixir. I'll keep it for later. Direi ottimo. Decorum guy. Stiamo trovando un sacco di roba. Ma veramente tanta. Ma giù di qua cosa c'è? Non posso andarci, benissimo. Come non detto Ma sto posto è grandissimo Cioè È immenso Oh Prendiamoci un Ecco Così almeno abbiamo Recuperato un po' la concentrazione Per Le domande complicate Non posso andarci ma forse non è che tipo sia un giro tondo, probabilmente. Ok, non troveremo mai la nostra stanza, già capito. È introvabile. Ma se dormiamo tipo, non so, nel divano, quasi quasi, facciamo prima. <ride> Così, a random. Un sacco di monete stiamo trovando Davvero tante Se mai volete trovare la mia stanza Un'altra moneta E poi President George Washington Ah, qua c'è il vecchio Washington mm, Ho sentito un rumore A drachma. Un dracma? Ah, una moneta sempre No, non avevo capito, pensavo fosse una cosa diversa Per un attimo Ho pensato potesse essere una cosa di... Diverso Pappa reale Buono, buono Un'altra moneta Ormai Andiamo a fare la spesa Di sto passo Ma la mia stanza è questa qui No ah, Prima o poi arriverà la nostra stanza eh. Lo so, lo so Oh però prima vorrei finire di esplorare tutto quanto il posto, visto che siamo già qui. Giusto per approfondimento. Duke Manuel Godoy. Poi magari non troverà niente, però. Vabbè, ah siamo tornati praticamente qua, dove eravamo prima. Abbiamo fatto il giro più lungo che c'era da fare. Vabbè. Ragazzi, andiamo in stanza. A questo punto. 
Vediamo com'è la stanza. Ah, mortacci. Bella. Right. So what shall I do with this letter? It might be about my mother's disappearance. Ma io la leggerei. But if I open it, I'll be betraying Piaggi's trust. What should I do? Mm. Ah, non posso, non ho questa abilità. Che faccio? Che faccio? Che faccio? Vabbè, ma ma a me di Piaggi. Che me frega. Ok. Let's see what it contains. Too bad for Piaggi. So, it really is a list of French countrymen. Piaggi wasn't lying. But now it's opened. I better get it to mother soon. Ecco, sicuro che ci, ci sgammerà. Sicuro, sicuro, eh. Wow. Nice room. Mortimer sure doesn't do things halfway. Sì, però ha, ha dei quadri terribili, ragazzi. Cioè, sono bruttissimi questi quadri. Ma ma che è? Cioè Ma è roba da, da malati questa Vabbè Io in una stanza così Non ci dormirei eh Ah si può andare anche fuori Ma bellino questo Ma che è? Cioè è un posto per... Per gente fumata Acqua di Melissa Lo stato concentrato Great Honey Perché no? Allontanati Ma posso guardare Vabbè mi sa che non troverei niente eh? The Greek drachma One of the rare ancient coins to be mentioned Both in the Bible and in the Quran Questa bottiglia così Vabbè La bottiglia è de... uno che si voleva buttare giù dal, dal... <ride> dal terrazzo probabilmente poi avevi visto quei quadri che sono veramente brutti Ha pensato al suicidio Inferno by Dante Abandon hope all ye who enter here Bello. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests Very jolly Sì è un posto veramente depresso questo eh Ma non posso Mamma mia che, che, che scatole Saint Francis of Assisi in ecstasy Before superior voices The conversion of Saint Paul Caravaggio. It's incredible. It doesn't look like a copy, but I was sure the original was in Rome. Saturn devouring his son. Again? I saw the same theme in the hall. I wouldn't like to be his son. Saint Jerome and the Angel. Yet again, art with political undertones with an image of a saint hearing voices. Judith beheading Holofernes. Ironic in a way. And you know that the artist represented herself as Judith beheading her mentor, who had raped her. Hmm. Un'altra acqua. Questi invece non posso leggerli per dire. Eh, sai no. Vabbè. Cavolo, che detto. Bello spazioso. Hai capito? Il lusso, c'è anche l'uva. Così. Però non, le coperte non ci sono, eh. Episodio 1. Ah, l'abbiamo finito. Un confronto fallito. Non ho trovato tutti gli indizi su mia madre a molo, ma come? Ci ho guardato benissimo. Però ho fatto quasi tutto. Avrei potuto fare una cosa alternativa. Sì, parlare con il signor Washington nel salone. Vabbè. Però non sono andato male, eh. Mi ha preso il livello. Quattro punti disponibili. Eeeh, dai. Così. Questo invece cos'è? Allora, una cosa che può aiutarci 
Eh, sotterfugi. I sotterfugi potrebbero aiutarci, ragazzi. In un qualche modo. Ah. Davvero? Hai etichetta. Non posso. Un punto in scienza. In persuasione. Io farei la persuasione, sinceramente. Che va sempre bene, in una qualche maniera. E andiamo avanti. Andiamo avanti. Anzi, andiamo avanti. Possiamo chiudere qua l'episodio. Magari dopo questa visione qua. Un altro sogno. Sono confuso. Your turn. The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted given that they must keep an eye on Adams. I can take care of her, you know. Yes. Well, in any case, I do thank you for bringing her to the island. From what I've understood, the search of de Richet's room hasn't turned up any results. Not yet, no. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Hmm. That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will meet him tomorrow. Oh, what a pity to lose a knight at the start of the game. Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During our game of chess? Don't worry, Gregory. The game won't disappear. I'll have one of my men escort you back. Don't trouble yourself. I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this late hour. It is never too late. Qui è. And we have much to discuss. One last move? Don't worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Come, come, take a seat, my friend. Ah, Napoleone buona parte, vedo lì. Io praticamente sto seguendo il tizio nel sogno. Perché, d'altronde, sembra così. Nighttime stroll, Mr. President. There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir. Wow, veramente wow. Perché sto sanguinando? Ma sanguino ogni volta che vedo queste, queste visioni praticamente, ma non capisco perché. Ragazzi, io direi che è tutto per il momento. Um, possiamo fermarci qua. Si sta rivedendo una trama... Molto bella, a mio parere, molto complicata, molto contorta, psicologicamente parlando. E niente, ci becchiamo alla prossima. Grazie, alla prossima. Ciao ragazzi.